What's happening, Rock Falls Middle School? David Flood here coming back with a little reminder message. First of all, I want to say thank you. I should say thank you before I remind you of the challenges I gave you. Uh, I hope some of you remember me. I was there a couple weeks ago, and I wanted to come back and say thank you for the way that you treated me when I was there. I felt very welcome. I walk into a lot of schools every year and don't know, well, most of the time I feel welcome, but you made me feel exceptionally welcome, so how's that? So thank you for that, for the way you treated me with respect. Um, for my time there and especially during my my talk. Um, so now that that's out of the way, let re me remind you of the challenges I gave you when I was there to always, number one, look on the inside of people, not judge people by the outside and look on the inside. Uh, if you start there by looking at someone and saying we are, that person's just like me, your life will go so much more smoothly. Um, you'll have a lot less problems with people, I promise. So always look on the inside. Second challenge was to reach out, say thank you to, connect with, show respect for two adults in your building. It's so important um, to being connected with two adults when you when things are going good and when things are going bad. Um, someone that you can talk to. So make sure you show respect and connect with adults, especially in middle school. It's an important time, you know, because when you you want to have that habit created when you get to the high school, so you know how to uh, how to talk to your teachers and all the adults in the building, not just the teachers. And the third challenge and the one that was most important to me and closest to my heart was that no one should eat alone. And look for places anywhere during your day where you can include people in the lunchroom, in the classroom, on the bus, at recess, in gym, in the conversation, in the hallway, anywhere. You know, try and include as many people as possible. Expand your circles. Inclusion, that's the key. There's a lot of people walking around who need to be included in things. So reach out to them. I had an awesome time uh, at the middle school, and I'm very, very grateful for you having me. I hope I get to see some of you down the road. Eighth graders, you got a few more months, really more than that, six more months, and then you're on to the high school. So I wish you luck with that. And I hope, as I said, I hope I see some of you down the road. Have a great day, guys and girls.